Glenn and Lauren Good, late morning to two of you. Tomorrow, in fact, marks six months to the day of the fatal movie set shooting. And a new report was just released where the state of New Mexico, as you mentioned, just imposed the maximum fine possible. If standard industry practices were followed, the fatal shooting of Helena Hutchins and the serious injury to Joel Souza would not have occurred. Almost six months to the day after the fatal shooting of cinematographer Helena Hutchins on the set of the film Rust, the state of New Mexico and their Occupational Safety and Health Administration is out with their findings into the investigation. There were several management failures. The report finds that Rust Movie Productions, LLC, new safety measures were not being followed. When a prop gun on the set, which was being held by the film star actor Alec Baldwin, fired on set, killing the film's cinematographer and injuring the film's director. Our OSHA investigators have determined that Rust Production failed in their obligation to provide a workplace free of recognized hazards. The state of New Mexico will now fine the production company $136,793, the maximum fine allowed in the state. They have 15 business days after receiving the citation to either pay the fine or contest. Production of the film has been suspended. That's indefinitely. Actor Alec Baldwin is also among the producers of that film. He said he did not pull the trigger, and he's denied any wrongdoing and said he should not be held liable. Helena Hutchins' family, she's the cinematographer who passed away. The family has sued Baldwin and other film producers in a wrongful death lawsuit. We'll have more on some of the legal analysis of the story coming up in the next hour. But for now, Mark Mester, live in the newsroom, KTLA 5 News. All right, thank you, Mark.